All right, let's take a look at the problem behind me. Let's do a little bit of algebra today. Yesterday we did some calculus, so I thought we'd do some algebra today. A couple of things with inequalities. Anytime we multiply or divide both sides by a negative, we have to flip the symbol. Okay? So let's take a look at this one. 1 minus 2b is greater than or equal to 5. Let's start by subtracting 1 from both sides. That gives me negative. Don't forget to bring down that negative sign. Negative 2b is greater than or equal to 5 minus 1 is 4. Step 2, get b by itself. Let's divide both sides by negative 2. Now we are dividing by a negative, so that means we are going to flip the symbol like that. And the negative 2's divide out. 4 divided by negative 2 is negative 2. So we get that b is less than or equal to negative 2. Now if you're asked to graph this, and sometimes we are, you will use a closed circle at negative 2, and then you will shade to the left. And kind of a key thing to remember with this is as long as your variable is first, the symbol should always be the same direction as the uh, arrow that you're shading in. So this is b is less than or equal to negative 2. If you're asked to put this in interval notation, a lot of students in algebra are not, that would be uh, everything from negative infinity to negative 2 with a bracket around the negative 2 because it can equal negative 2. Good luck. Have fun.